Good evening, WWE Universe, and welcome back to another edition of WWE Slam. We emanate from the heart of Orlando this evening as you join me, the Revolution, alongside my broadcast colleagues, Michael Cole, Byron Saxon, and the delightful Corey Gray. During our last broadcast in New York, we celebrated the women of ECW in our ECW One Night Stand 13th Anniversary Special, a night full of betrayals, surprise returns featuring a whole host of WWE and ECW legends. We also crowned our first ever Slam Women's Tag Team Champions in the form of Becky Lynch and Charlotte Flair after defeating Team BAD in a Tag Team Championship ladder match. During our live special, it was revealed by Interim General Manager Miss Vicky Guerrero that Slam Superstar Emma would be suspended after challenging Raquel Diaz for the Slam Women's Championship after weeks of tension between the two former best friends. How will the Slam roster react to this news? Stay tuned to WWE Slam for all that and more here tonight. It was revealed just moments ago that our next pay-per-view will be none other than Money in the Bank. Over the next five weeks, the women of WWE Slam will be competing in qualifying matches to secure their spot in this year's briefcase ladder match. In the first of our opening qualifying matches, it was revealed that Slam's newest signing, Brie Bella, will go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Liv Morgan in our main event of the evening. Will Brie Bella's look continue later this evening, or will the blonde bombshells run riot on Brie? Stay tuned to WWE Slam to find out later this evening. However, up next, Sasha Banks and Charlotte Flair go toe to toe after Charlotte and Becky Lynch's Tag Team Championship victory.
The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, accompanied by Becky Lynch from the Queen City, one half of the Women's Tag Team Champions, Charlotte. Here we go. This is the match a lot of these people came to see tonight. And with good reason, Michael, this one's been brewing for quite some time. Byron, I think these women may be caught off guard a bit by the stellar crowd reaction they're receiving here. I don't know why, Michael. It seems like they get one of the biggest reactions each and every week. you think they'd be used to it by now. Time singles matches on deck here, and Byron, what should we expect to see here tonight? Well, given the shape these superstars appear to be in here tonight, I fully expect to see one of the most competitive matches we've seen in a very long time. Guys, I don't recall the last time I saw these women more focused than they look right now. It's a big match, Cole. To expect anything less from these women here tonight would be just plain silly. Based on the electricity that's traveling through this arena and decibel level of the crowd, I think it's safe to say the roof of this building just might blow off. And with the women's division as white hot as it is right now, you just know this match is gonna be one for the ages. And it's worth noting that we are just a few miles from the WWE Performance Center, which means there are plenty of WWE hopefuls in the back studying this one. that haven't seen her, what is she going to do here to try and win? She's certainly a force, Cole, but you have to remember who she's in the ring with there, too. Neither of these girls are pushovers, that's for sure. I do expect her to show her opponent and the rest of the WWE that she's going to be someone to reckon with for a long time to come. She's looking at it early. And Sasha Banks pops the shoulder up. That's either sheer genius or complete stupidity, Cole. Drops the knee with a vengeance. Oh, on his stomach. Boston Crab. Boston Crab locked in. No, she breaks it. Wow, she's quite the escape artist, Michael.
She's definitely energized, but she bet she's got the shoulders down. Pen broken up easily. Clearly not enough damage done. Here she comes on the counter. We'll see if she can turn things around. Look at the look in her eyes. She's in the zone now. Nope, that one misses. Boy, that was terrible. Charlotte into the cover. She's looking to end it early. Oh, no. She's in a bad way now. Look at her here. She's just reveling the opportunity to make a mockery of her opponent. Looking for the quick pin. Oh, man, they don't even seem hurt after that. She is ready for a fight tonight. When she gets in attack mode, look out. What does Charlotte need to do now to remain a factor in this match? This is not at all where she hoped to be at this point in the match. Yeah, I'm surprised by this. It's almost as if she can't seem to kick it into high gear here. She counters before it's too late. Oh, now it's the boss with a little smack talk. A little jealousy, perhaps, as she goes for the face. What the? I can't believe what she's getting away with. Come on, Raph. She's definitely energized, but she better make sure she saves something for later. Comes up big with a reversal. what's gonna happen this match could go any shoulders down is it enough a kick out at two and a half she got her shoulder up and we continue got him turned over the boston crab she's got her where she wants her and she breaks free i don't know how she did it that shoulders down this could be it true testament to grit she kicked out there but i don't know how much more she can take she reverses out of it and not a second too soon close call there you can see the confidence just beaming from her right now she needs to find a way to get to her feet time is of the essence here too michael she look at this Here comes Sasha Banks. Bankrupt. I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. Yeah, I'm pretty sure our table just shook a bit. Sasha Banks got her there. Will this be it? Where is she finding the strength to continue? I can't believe she kicked out there. She wants to finish this. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. Now there's the counter. It could be over here. One, two. The singles match has come to an end. Wow.
Here is your winner, Charlotte. Talk about having to dig down deep to pick up the win. Wow, when you pick up a pinfall victory over somebody like that, you've done something right. We've got an animated crowd here tonight, as we usually do when we're in Orlando. Please welcome my guest at this time, WWE Sam's newest signing, Brie Bella. Congratulations on your win at ECW, Brie. What does it mean to be part of the Slam roster? Will being away from bed not be a detriment to your time here in Slam? Well, I for one don't think it's Connie, and it sends a great message to those back home. However, we do have to switch our focus to the main event of the evening. It's been over a year since your last match in WWE. That must add some huge pressure. Any last words for the WWE Universe? Thanks for your time, Brie, and good luck later tonight. It seems though so. Sasha can't catch a break here in WWE Slam in recent months after yet another loss, this time at the hands of Charlotte Flair. Sasha clearly looked disappointed in the outcome of the match, and we can only hope her unlucky streak turns around. Still to come on WWE Slam in our main event of the evening, Brie Bella and Liv Morgan go head to head for their shot in this year's Money in the Bank ladder match. Will the blonde bombshell's very own Liv Morgan be able to topple Brie in Brie's first singles match in recent years? Stay tuned to WWE Sam for our main event of the evening. However, up next we hear from Raquel Diaz following her championship defense in ECW against former friend Emma. Who will answer Raquel's open invitation this evening? It's time to find out. We have one-on-one -on -one action on the way, and this one should be nothing short of amazing. I don't doubt that for a moment, Michael. In fact, I would go so far as to say this match might just steal the show. Byron, what do you think about the shape these women appear to be in right now? They've clearly been prepping for this one. Oh, without a doubt, Michael. I don't know specifically what they're doing inside the gym, but it's definitely working.
and her opponent from California, Awesome Call. Ladies and gentlemen, it's now time for one-on-one -on -one action. And Michael, it sounds to me like this crowd already picked the one who they want to win this match. Yeah, and for me, tonight will go a long way in determining exactly which woman is the most dominant in WWE. Same here, Michael. I'd say it's almost impossible to overstate the importance of this match, especially as it relates to where in the pecking order the winner will end up. From New Zealand, Donna K. Guys, we have two of WWE's most exciting superstars ready to square off here. And there's nothing quite like seeing two superstars settling it in the ring in one on one action, Michael. Byron, many people are saying that these women are the top competitors in the division. Would you agree with that assessment? Well, the women's division certainly is stacked right now, Michael. But yeah, these competitors definitely stand out when thinking about the top women. This is a one-on-one -on -one match. We've got trouble here, guys. Looks like somebody came into tonight ultra-motivated. Big-time slam right there. Look out below. That body flying through the air lands like a bomb. What does Cobb need to do to win tonight? For the benefit of our newer audience members, what can they expect to see from this woman? Woman versus woman never gets up. She comes up with a slam. Here's her chance. Can she do it here? One, two, three. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. Here is your winner, Awesome Call. Wow, huge pinfall win here tonight. That's a big win right there. Anytime you can pin another WWE competitor's shoulders to the mat for the three count, you should be proud.
Another deceiving moment from Raquel Diaz yet again has seen moments ago as karma decimated NXT's very own Dakota Kai. We send our well wishes to the fan favourite, however we must change our focus to the main event of the evening as Brie Bella goes toe to toe with Liv Morgan in her first singles match since giving birth. Will Brie somehow manage to pull out another victory or will Liv Morgan claim the very first spot in this year's Money in the Bank ladder match? Our main event of the evening starts now. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring, accompanied by the Princess of Staten Island, Carmella, and from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Lee Morgan. We have one-on-one -on -one action on the way, and this one should be nothing short of amazing. I don't doubt that for a moment, Michael. In fact, I would go so far as to say this match might just steal the show. And to build on that, when it comes to the women's division, I'd say it doesn't get much more exciting. It's time for Brie mode, guys. And you can bet Birdie will be watching her mom in action from back home. Byron, what do you think about the shape these women appear to be in right now? They've clearly been prepping for this one. Oh, without a doubt, Michael. I don't know specifically what they're doing inside the gym, but it's definitely working. Based on the electricity that's traveling through this arena and decibel level of the crowd, I think it's safe to say the roof of this building just might blow off. The collar and elbow tie up in a battle for control here. Into the chin lock. What do you think's going through Morgan's mind? What can our newer viewers expect from this woman? You can take your tag team and your fatal four ways. Give me some one-on-one -on -one WWE action every single time. Brie Bella's on the attack now. We're witnessing a level of punishment that can only be described as severe. Plenty of force behind that knee. Morgan not looking good here. She's going to have to make sure this... Hoping to end it early. And an early kick out in this unusual matchup. That would have been a shocker. Green Bella's on the attack now. Uh-oh. What is Bree Bella going to do here? I think she's a challenger. Gets out of a tough situation there. And that was impressive, Cole. There was almost no escaping that one. And it's reversed. And she's toying with her now. She's not too anxious to get up. Can you believe that? Oh, and it's 
a reversal. For some competitors, part of their strategy is to demean their opponent. A move like that says it all. And a perfectly executed stretch. Ah, oh, she gets out of it. She has renewed life now, Michael. Really relying on that elbow here. Connects with a counter. She wants to finish this. A wise woman would stay down. Dare I say that was an angelic senton? Not so fast. When she gets in attack mode, look out. Bringing it back into the ring. Here comes Brie. Oh, those kicks look familiar. Yeah, don't they? The yes kicks from Brie Bella. Oh, that's it. That's got to be it. Brie Bella. Now that's a finishing move, people. That has got to be it. She needs to find a way to get to her feet. Time is of the essence here, too, Michael. What's going to happen to her pretty face? This is going too far now. Well executed clothesline. Look out! She's practically motionless right now, Corey. And she's probably wondering what she's got herself into right about now. Yes, Lock! Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here. That's not even remotely comfortable looking. The pressure's too much. They tapped. Here is your winner, Brie Bella. Nice victory here tonight for Brie Bella. There's no way around it. When you're locked in a submission move like that, your only choice is to tap out. Guys, it sounds like we can all agree that was an extremely impressive win. Thanks for tuning in to WWE Slam. As always, I've been your host of Revolution, and we hope you've enjoyed tonight's episode of WWE Slam. Be sure to leave a comment below, tweet us at Revolution, or head on over to www.therevolution.co.uk to keep up with all things WWE Slam. Tune in next week to see what's in store for the Women of Slam, because you never know who might turn up. Until next time...